Premier Su Zhen Chang strapped on an apron today to fry up some Taiwanese grouper. At a professional event, promotional event for the fish, he condemned China for halting grouper imports from Taiwan in the latest string of trade suspensions. Su reiterated that China had violated international trade rules. He said China's allegations of toxins in the fish were unfounded, as all grouper examined by Taiwanese authorities had passed inspections. Oh, yo. Oh. <laughs> Dressed in an apron, Premier Su Jin Chang is a chef's assistant for the day. He shows off his skills, giving the fish a light flip in the pan. In less than 10 minutes, an Italian-style grouper entree is served. Following China's ban on Taiwan grouper, more than 500 tons of the fish have been ordered by Taiwanese businesses. On Wednesday, Premier Su hailed the businesses for supporting local fish. Today, I would like to express my special thanks to convenience stores and chain stores across the country, including grocery stores. Everyone is working together to bolster sales. From Adamoya to Grouper, China has banned many agricultural products from Taiwan over the past few years. China has arrogantly and abruptly violated the conventions of international trade, saying that our products fell short of their standards. In our own inspections, we found that our products fully complied with the standards. We want China to make decisions based on scientific evidence. Everyone should abide by international trade practices. That's the reasonable way to do it. Also on Wednesday, President Tsai Ing-wen attended the opening of the Food Taipei trade show. In her address, she broached the issue of China's grouper ban. Recently, China made the unilateral move of suspending grouper imports from Taiwan. Many nations with whom Taiwan shares the values of democracy have come forward to support Taiwanese aquaculture. For example, a fish farmer in Fukushima, Japan, has said that he will show his support for Taiwan by eating its freedom. Fish. Tsai expressed thanks to a Japanese entrepreneur who pledged to support Taiwan Grouper in its hour of need.